Hello and welcome. Thank you for joining our webinar today focused on AMAG's symmetry solutions and services available to our channel and customers. I'm Kim Rayfeld, Director of Media Relations, and I am your host today. We have a lot going on at AMAG, and these webinars provide important updates, drive awareness of AMAG's new symmetry solutions, share best practices, and dive into unique product features that will help you differentiate your company from others when you team up with us. If you have any questions throughout this webinar, please type them into the question box or the chat box there, and we will address as many as we can after the webinar. And we will certainly follow up with any questions that we didn't get to um, after the webinar also. On today's webinar, we have AMAG's Director of Sales, Chris Randall, and Vice President of Product Management, Jonathan Moore. Today, we will be highlighting how Symmetry can help organizations meet security and compliance requirements in a post-pandemic work environment. We are also starting a new segment where we are going to review more unknown or rather less used features of Symmetry that might surprise you and help your organization. I will then provide a brief marketing update. AMAG has grown beyond access control to transform into a total solution provider, focusing on mitigating risk, reducing cost, and ensuring compliance. In our previous webinars, webinars, we have introduced what AMAG is doing in different areas of our business beyond access control to help our reseller channel, our consultant community, and our end users solve problems. AMAG is an end-to-end -end solutions provider with a robust ecosystem of best-of-breed technology partners that work together to provide a complete solution for you. All of our webinars and much more are available on our YouTube channel, which can be found at the link there at the bottom of the screen. Again, I want to remind you that if you have any questions, please type them into the question box. So now we will turn it over to Director of Sales, Chris Randall. Good morning, thanks, Kim. Uh, I'll obviously be covering return to work um, and starting on the first slide, Greg, which is the next one, ensuring safety, security, and productivity. AMAG technology works closely with customers as a trusted advisor, providing technology leading security solutions that solve challenges in many environments. As businesses start to open up, organizations will have new security and compliance challenges to tackle. Our symmetry solutions can help you enforce safety and security and meet new compliance requirements. Next. Health assurance with Symmetry Mobile and Zenitel Audio. Organizations need to ensure employees are healthy before allowing them back into a facility. The Symmetry Mobile Access app delivers a customizable questionnaire that must be completed before an employee's physical or mobile access credentials are activated. If the employee's answers do not align with the company policies, the individual's access credentials can be disabled. Companies can also choose how often employees need to answer these questions, putting the organization in control while keeping employees safe. There is also a record of the event if the organization needs to share that data. If an employee does not have the app, Symmetry Intelligent Audio, Intelligence Audio can conduct a verbal interview and record it for auditing purposes and compliance requirements. Next. Business resiliency with Symmetry Incident Management and Zenitel Audio. Companies need to ensure their work environment remains safe when people return. Symmetry incident management can help implement return to work protocols. And as new procedures are implemented, security personnel can use symmetry incident management to communicate and track incidents, especially as they relate to COVID-19 specific challenges. Detailed workflows assist security personnel with the proper steps to take. Ensure proper protocols are followed and compliance is met. Security personnel will understand how events unfold through notifications, detailed narratives, and site-specific related information. 
This can also be linked to other systems within departments, such as HR, to provide an even more powerful tool to analyze new cases, identify hotspot areas, and provide data to make better decisions. An audit trail tracks the entire process and provides information to meet compliance requirements. Receptionists and security personnel can communicate with visitors remotely from reception desks, limiting the need for face-to-face -face communication during the pre-screening process. Using Symmetry Intelligent Audio, stations and speakers at doors and entrances allow communication with visitors prior to admitting them into the facility. Adding elbow, foot, or alternative switches can further reduce risk of contact between infected and uninfected individuals. Next. Occupancy and throughput assurance with business intelligence and symmetry guest. In the post-pandemic environment, it may become important to know how many people are inside a facility at a given time. Symmetry business intelligence tracks facility occupancy, helping to minimize exposure and enforce government guidelines. Understanding facility usage helps organizations keep their building occupancy at reasonable levels. In Symmetry Guest, visitor management automates all processes associated with the life cycle of the visitor to a facility. Know who is in your facility and how long they have been there. Automatically terminate access when the visit time expires, limiting the number of visitors in a facility. When a specific threshold of visitors are registered each day, Symmetry Guest can send an email notification stating the visitor level has been reached. Next, workspace control solutions with Symmetry Business Intelligence, Symmetry Blue, and Audio. Employees need to have workspaces that conform to new standards. Health authorities recommend implementing workspace controls to limit the spread of infection. Symmetry Business Intelligence can discreetly and anonymously track office usage to determine heavily trafficked areas. Access to rich data and powerful insights highlight where people congregate in a workspace and at what times of day. By understanding this data, organizations can more adequately provide workspace controls for physical distancing if necessary. And by understanding where employees have been, organizations can determine which areas are in the most need of deep cleaning. Symmetry Blue readers offer a touchless solution and can integrate with biometric devices equipped with facial recognition to minimize exposure to potentially contaminated surfaces. Employees can use their personal phones to open doors rather than an access card or pin pad reader, reducing the need to touch more areas. And intelligent audio provides clear communications when physical distancing is essential or automated instructions are needed. For example, in hospitals and airports where instructions are given to employees and visitors, such as please remain six feet apart or masks are required while inside the building. Next. Manage security from home, right? With Symmetry Complete View. With the rise of remote work, different bandwidth management solutions allow security teams to securely access video regardless of their location. Network connection or client device without any additional cost or complexity. Symmetry Complete View video management dynamic resolution scaling reduces the required bandwidth needed to serve users without any sacrifice to video quality. This capability makes it easy for users to access video from Symmetry Complete View VMS using any client, including web browsers and mobile devices, without any additional cost or complexity. Dynamic resolution scaling and, uh, enables rapid access to live and pre-recorded video at low latency and allows organizations to enable more users to access more cameras while consuming less bandwidth. Physical distancing and contact tracing with Symmetry Mobile, Audio, Symmetry Movement Impact Tool, and Symmetry Guest. As organizations reopen, they may, they may need to encourage and enforce physical distancing among staff and visitors. For organizations who have migrated to a mobile credential solution, Symmetry will allow security teams to grant access directly to a mobile device 
eliminating the need to interact with the security team or go to the badging office, enforcing physical distancing. Security staff can also centrally manage all credentials, photos, and devices remotely. Intelligent audio provides an easy way to communicate while enforcing physical distancing. Zenitel's turbine video intercom station can sit alongside symmetry access control at an external entrance. Visitors can place a call by pressing a button or activating a contactless motion sensor. The security office officer or receptionist can visibly verify the caller while having a conversation with them, verifying the purpose of their visit, screening them for exposure before entering. Automatic messages can be played informing the visitor of company policies regarding physical distancing or mask wearing. If a visitor approaches an unmanned location, automated pre-recorded messages can be played to provide direction for their visit. The Symmetry Movement Impact Tool helps organizations track and trace individuals who have been exposed to the virus. This can help minimize the risk of potentially infected person spreading the virus to others and can help mitigate the risk of multiple infected employees, which could impact business productivity. It can track an employer, <clears throat> excuse me. It can track an employee or visitor and determine who else was in the same area at the same time as someone known to be infected. This audit trail is critical for the security team to notify those who have come into contact with the infected person. Ongoing reports can be generated to maintain compliance and meet ever-changing regulations. Contact tracing puts employees and visitors at ease knowing, knowing they will be notified if they have been exposed to an infected person, enabling them to take appropriate steps to quarantine and or be tested for the virus. And finally, Symmetry Guest Visitor Management assists with contact tracing by prompting the receptionist or security officer to ask visitors specific questions related to self-declaration. Have you been in contact with anyone who's displayed symptoms, for instance? And can be used to alert personnel if any answers that may require secondary screening are provided. Designed for employees and visitors to provide basic contact information, Symmetry Guest delivers contact tracing benefits via reports that can show a contact list of who was in the building, when they were there, whom they met with, and a phone number to reach them. And that's it for, for me, Kim. Uh, the next segment will be bonus, did you know? Certainly uh, my favorite part, quite frankly. Uh, and Jonathan Moore, our VP of Product Development, will be uh, hosting this segment. Thank you. Thanks, Chris. And uh, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, as Chris said, I'm, I'm Jonathan Moore. I'm VP of Product Management here at AMAG, and I will be introducing everybody to a, a, a new segment that we have in these webinars, being a, a did you know section. So if we want to jump to the next slide, we can get started. But basically, this section is to discuss uh, new and interesting features that we may have released recently. It can also be uh, a, an opening for me to, to introduce you to features that maybe are buried in one of our products that are, I, I feel are particularly useful or have come up recently. And maybe everybody out there doesn't know about these features. So just gonna touch on some new and interesting things that, that, that are going on here at AMAG. And today I'm focusing on a couple of things within our connect and guest identity and visitor management platforms. So uh, very recently, we introduced uh, into that product the ability to handle multiple languages. So, so we did the development to be able to support non-English languages, including uh, what I term right-to-left languages, um, uh, the languages that don't necessarily go from left to right across the page. And why that's important is because uh, the user interface has to be able to account for those languages that maybe go in a different direction or something like that. So very happy to say that, that this development is complete. Our host environment uh, already contains English and Spanish at this point for both Connect and Guest. Uh, each individual user can go into those products and select their sort of default or, or preferred language. So, um, you know, one user could be seeing the software in English and another user could be seeing that software in Spanish. And that's available in our hosted environment today. We are also working on a long list of, of additional languages. That, that are available out. Some have already been released and, and other languages are shortly within the next month or two going to be released. 
Those are available in our on-premise uh, versions today uh, or, or, or in private cloud as well. So uh, if you have any particular language requirements, please reach out to your, your local sales rep and, and, and let us know. But a uh, great new feature that, that's been added recently and uh, just wanted everybody to, to be aware. So let's jump to, to the next slide. So here's an example of uh, some features that are available within the guest visitor management solution that we've kind of been dripping these features into the product over the last year or so. And when you combine these features together, they produce a really powerful outcome that I thought I would talk about today. So what we're gonna focus on today is a uh, temporary badge issuance within the product. So, uh, you know, Chris has been talking a little bit about return to work policies and, and people coming back to work. And I know if we start having more and more employees in the office, one of the things that they do is they forget the badge at home, right? Everybody's done it, you leave your badge behind. This is a very common problem that uh, I, I've been to see a lot of our customers in person, and this always comes up as a challenge, as a problem for, for customers to deal with is, you know, we have all these policies around access assignment and, and who gets what level of access, but if that person leaves their badge at home, that creates a problem um, of how do they actually get into these areas that they need to get to. So very happy to say that, that quite a while back, last year we released, uh, early last year we released uh, the temporary badge issuance feature within Symmetry Guest. So the way that this specific feature works is uh, if somebody forgets their badge, they could go to the reception and the security officer or the, the user in reception would be able to essentially register the employee for a, for a visit that's a temporary badge visit. So, so it's basically the employee's forgotten their badge and we're issuing them, new, them a new one. So they do that within the guest application. And then what happens in the background is when they're issued a, a temporary badge, the guest system goes into symmetry access control and assigns that temporary badge to the actual employee. And that's important because that employee can then inherit all the access they already had. So if I assign it to you, the employee, whatever access is assigned to you gets assigned to the temporary badge too. So, so you get the same level of access. You don't just get through the front door or something like that. You can go into all the areas that, that you can normally go to. So, so that's very, very important. Another thing that it does automatically in the access control system is it shuts down your permanent badge. If that system's configured accordingly, we shut down the permanent badge. So there's no chance of that employee giving their badge to somebody else and um, now having two active badges. The system issues them a temporary badge with the same level of access they've always had and then shuts down their permanent badge at the same time. So now that employee is free to go, they can go off and, um, you know, their temporary badge all day and then at the end of the day when they're either manually or automatically checked out we reverse the whole thing so now their permanent badge becomes active again and their temporary badge is is removed and uh, what's also important here is all of this information is tracked we can send their manager an email we can put this in a report so if somebody is constantly forgetting their badge we, we have an audit trail of that and, and we can address it in future. So with everybody coming back to work, I thought this was a great feature to talk about. Let's jump to the next slide and I'll, I'll show you a couple of other features that if you combine these together, make for a really powerful overall solution. So what I'm talking about here is that over the last year, we released, uh, actually one feature was more than a year ago, but visit approvals is a feature that we've added recently and automatic check-in is another feature that we've added uh, uh, recently. And then finally, the ability to store a visit pass or, or, or credential within a mobile phone, within the digital wallet on that phone that you see there creates an overall, provides you the ability to, to produce a workflow that's very, very powerful. So, so let me explain. So, if I'm an employee and I, I forget my badge, but I still have access to the, the guest system, if I have my laptop or my phone with me, what I could do in this situation is I could register myself for a temporary badge within the guest system. That can automatically go for approval via the visit approval feature. So that could go to my boss, that could go to security, could go to both my boss and security. They could approve, oh, Jonathan forgot his badge again, and they could approve that. And basically at that point, I could get a pass that works on a QR code reader that I can add to my wallet that you see there. And I could also be automatically checked in by the system. So I don't even have to go and see anybody at the front desk or anything. I get issued this digital pass 
with uh, same level of access as before. My um, permanent badge is shut down and it's all handled. Everybody gets the information they need. I'm not jumping through and skipping any steps here, but I've got a completely seamless temporary badge that was issued to me. Now, with the pass that I'm showing there, you would need a QR code reader. So it isn't identical in, in terms of physical card, but if you didn't want to use the QR code reader, this person could also go and get a badge issued at the front desk. So combining visit approvals with our automatic check-in feature and the digital pass that you see in that mobile wallet, along with that temporary badge feature, gives you a really complex but powerful workflow that's automated through that guest system. So that was our, our Did You Know um, uh, section for, for today. I hope everybody enjoyed it and found it interesting. Um, at this stage, I, I, my, my section is complete and I will, uh, I'll hand it over to Kim. Thanks, Jonathan. So I wanted to remind everybody that if you have any questions to uh, please type them in the chat box there. So the marketing team has been busy. Next slide, please. Developing new collateral to support our resellers and consultants and provide more information to our end users. So if you are interested in learning more about how Symmetry can help organizations in a post pandemic environment, please visit our new webpage at amag.com forward slash return dash to dash work. On that webpage, you'll find a link to our brand new brochure um, it's called Insurance Safety, Security, and Productivity with Symmetry Solutions. The brochure outlines the different challenges your organization might encounter now that employees are returning to the office or work environment um, with you know, the new security concerns that you might have as a result of the pandemic. The brochure um, complements what Chris covered um, earlier today in the webinar. So let me take a look and see if we have any questions. Looks like we have one. Um, let's see. With Symmetry Mobile, do you have recommended questions to ask employees before they enter a facility? And can those questions be edited? Uh, I, I can take that one. So thanks, Kim. So, so the question there being, uh, do we have a, a sort of recommended or default list of questions, I think, and, and can those be edited? Um, so. Yes, yeah, so, so the Symmetry Mobile return to work functionality as Chris was talking about briefly um, allows uh, employees to complete and answer questions before their, their uh, mobile or physical credentials are enabled. So I have to answer questions saying I'm healthy and, and, and not infected with anything, et cetera, et cetera. And then my badge is active and I'm allowed to come into work. So we do provide a default list of questions. We actually uh, looked at the uh, sort of expert bodies that are out there like the CDC and, and other um, uh, bodies that, that provide sort of recommended questions um, to, to be asked in that situation. And we leaned on those pretty heavily. So um, I'd actually looked at them fairly recently and, and I think the default questions we have are, are pretty good and comprehensive but they can be edited if you do need to do so. Uh, that's something AMAG takes care of internally. We just need a request to, to edit those questions. One thing I would say is we do wanna keep them short and sweet. People are, are typically responding to this on a mobile device. So you can't have a question that's like, you know, 400 words and have them respond to something. It, it just gets too busy. So we do need to limit the questions and limit the length of the questions and answers. So it fits on a mobile device. But yes, the answer to that is absolutely. We have default questions and yes, they can be changed. Thanks, Jonathan. I think that's all for the questions. So thank you to Chris and Jonathan and Greg, who's working his magic behind the scenes. If you have any questions, please reach out to your local AMEG salesperson and uh, we can set up a meeting with you. As always, the full webinar and previous webinars are um, hosted on our YouTube channel. Uh, the URL is right there on your screen there in the lower right corner. As soon as we end this webinar, a short survey will pop up in your browser. Please take a moment to fill that out so we can make sure that we are always delivering the best information on these webinars. Thank you again for joining and please join us again for our next webinar on July 20th at 1 p.m. Eastern. 10 p.m. Pacific. Have a great rest of your day.